Good afternoon, Newcastle, and uh, how are you doing on this Monday, the 12th of uh, August? And uh, coming at you a little coming at you a little bit early as um, we have um, there, there's a football meeting tonight we, we've got the number of things we have going on is truly incredible <clears throat> so um, we're going to get that news watch to you and that programming day out a little bit quick and tomorrow I'm going to tell you that if you watch NCLC Living you're going to see shots from the Holy Spirit Festival absolutely magnificent you're going to see Mahoning Town Community Day you're going to see Pearson Park Community Day. You're, you're going to see quite a bit of everything. That's NCLC Living coming at you, and that will be tomorrow. So uh, just to give you an idea what's going on and... Um, as we tune up the old button presser thing or but jigger here if I had uh, if I had my son or Tim behind the glass then uh, it would go a little bit faster but I don't so why complain uh, it looks like it's going to rain out there it's gone cloudy. I, there is construction, by the way, on Taylor Street. So um, if you're going at the bottom, say by Dean Park, uh, be prepared for construction there. As uh, they're still, um, they're doing a lot of digging uh, along that area. And... Um, not really sure what they're looking for, but that's what's that's what's going on. Now, uh, traffic downtown, not too bad, as uh, it, it is kind of, though, heavy, because we were on Mill Street, and um, it was... Uh, there was quite a few uh, people there, and they're racing across. And I got to tell you this: they're racing across Fall Street here, and uh, not really paying attention, trying to get all the lights green. Uh, that won't work. Uh, so uh, I'm going to tell you, as you go through that area, make sure that you slow down because it is tricky. Now, um, two more buttons, and uh, we've got it licked as uh, my pet fly flying around here. Would love that thing to fly towards the window. And uh, we'll start out giving you everything you need to know. And uh, there, we did it. Together, we got everybody Thank you, but I was pressing buttons, and that's why I was looking over there. No problem. 
Now the train is on the tracks and uh, Newswatch is straight ahead for you, Tolly. You think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County? Then think again! Always stay connected to NCTV45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are Newswatch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV45, anytime on your time. Tired of being stuck in the house and relying on others to take you places? Let ACTS be your professional driving service. Did you know that ACTS is more than just medical transportation? From trips to shopping, beauty salons, work, and play, ACTS is here to get you there. We offer special low fares for senior citizens and passengers with disabilities. No income restrictions. For more info, give us a call or check out our website. Acts, moving you forward. Yes, it's New Age Graphics. For signs, wraps, banners, printing, Dan Ferry, owner, gives you such quality work, you'll be amazed. Don't be afraid to call him. Office, 724-656-4934. Fax, 724-656-9320. Sale, 724-651-8769. They're located at 1031 Butler Avenue in Newcastle. D Ferry at NewAgeSigns.com. NewAgeSigns.com. When you're looking for that professional look. Pegley's. Hus them more. When you're hungry for that great Italian taste, bellissimo. It is tremendous. You have to stop by Pegley's for pasta, sandwiches, pizza. Yes, it's Pegley's Pasta and More for that great Italian taste. It's not just for Sunday anymore. Head over to Pegley's. Simple elegance in a majestic setting. Yes, right here in downtown Newcastle. Minutes away from shopping, seconds from a gas station, and let's not forget pastries, a restaurant, and oh yes, the schools. The majestic, for that majestic lifestyle, right in the greatest castle, Newcastle. Come by and take a look. And you know, we're back. And um, this is a chance for you to feel just like the homework, Jim. Now, I got, I got a tremendous idea. And, and you could do this. Why did I say that? I happen to know that on the weekends they play those Christmas stuffs. And, they, and, and you know, I put this right at the top of my list. Because this Saturday, Lawrence County Abate Toy Run, August 17th, that's Saturday. Music, Food, and Raffles, Wild Bill's Barbecue Buffet. It's going to be Italian this year. I'll tell you about that in a second. Please help with a cash donation or an unwrapped toy. So, you bring a toy. They're going to have a buffet and a live band. Lawrence County Abate 
eighth annual toy run and where do you register at our longtime friend the branding iron the run starts and ends at the branding iron 11 30 to 1 that's the toy run <laughs> location last bike in at 5 p.m rain or shine maps of the run and stops are <coughs> available this is two two twenty two twenty one ben franklin highway <coughs> now let me explain from our location this is fall street that's called the fall street bypass you go down you go out samson street come to the light in the harbor when you go past the light in the harbor right on the left hand side is the branding iron it is tremendous tremendous food and everything i've been there love it show your support and then this is a christmas look they have a lot santa claus here music food <laughs> raffles for more information call the branding iron 724-658-1210 tell bobby <laughs> that i sent you or call big bob at 724-971-0663 and um have a great time it, it is going to be fun and then when you're home because you did something nice you could watch one of those little christmas stories on homework you know listen they're going to have pasta rigatoni or spaghetti meatball or sausage and i bet if you don't want to have the pasta you can have a meatball sandwich or sausage sandwich okay and they have t-shirts till they're gone so in that some now that's a that's a terrific idea and you know how to be your wife or girlfriend's best friend I think I nailed it for you you know what she'll go oh you're so sweet and you'll get to go shopping with her to pick out the toy geez oh man you know, tell me you don't get that information right here at NCTV45. Guess what? We uh, we aim to please getting you that important stuff. Now, um, back to school family event at the YMCA Friday the 16th. And do you believe we're talking about that? Back to school. Holy cow. I have no idea where this summer went. This is at the downtown. Why? From 6 to 8. It's a family fun night. And uh, they just have a good time. So you should definitely, definitely check out the downtown Why on this. Uh, tell them NCTV 45 sent you to. Now, this, this story has been perplexing me for at least two weeks. And I am all wound up about this. So just hang in there and I'm going to definitely... <coughs> click <coughs> all these buttons <coughs> now first of all the white's putting it on and then you've got these places now what's all that about this story has driven me crazy because I couldn't find the pictures. Listen to this. Now this is going on. 
I know it started on the 8th, and I've been telling you about it. But it's going on for some time. Okay, this is at the confluence. It's called, it's all in the details. A new exhibit of photography and architectural drawings celebrating the beauty of Lawrence County and the architectural past and present. Now, we've had some beautiful stuff here. This exhibit was inspired by Lawrence County Partners in Prevention Preservation Annual Photograph Competition, which tends to focus on the many interesting architectural details of historic buildings through the county. First place, making a grand entrance. Okay. And this is the Jeffer Jameson Mansion, Jefferson Street. Second place, Heavenly Patina, St. Elias Orthodox Church. And third place, Open the Past, 330 North Jefferson Street, Bobby Jean Hines Campbell of New Galilee. Now, there was first place, there was second place. There was third place. What a great exhibit. And they've got more. They've got uh, suspension, final tribute, church windows, people's choice, the view, and uh, this is the part that I've been telling you about. The bulk of the exhibit, however, features historical collections from architectural renderings drafted by the century-old firm of Eccles Architecture at the turn of the century. Many of these, like the Stratmaster Building on East Washington Street, now that's formerly Lanigan's, okay, Okay, and others to be recognized. So get down to the confluence and take a look at these photos and renderings. They're unreal. And uh, that, that was my driving you crazy because I definitely wanted to show you that. It, it just, wow. Now, You know, I hope wherever the Pirates are playing, it doesn't rain. It would be a shame for Mother Nature to break their streak of losing. They've had three wins since the All-Star break. Which, it just, wow. Wow. Like, you expect a slump, but, like, now let's go to the Cedar Sports Corner and check it out. And then we'll be right back. I got plenty more here where that came from. We'll be right back. Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedars features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side at 827 Addis Street, Newcastle, 724. The Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedars features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side. Sylvan Heights Golf Course in Newcastle, Pennsylvania features many amenities, lush fairways, and great 
greens and many challenging shots your crowd will applaud a short drive from Butler, Sharon, Pittsburgh, Elwood and Youngstown it's Sylvan Heights Golf Course in Newcastle, Pennsylvania Hello and welcome once again to the Cedar Sports Corner and let's get to Major League Baseball Pirates will be in Los Angeles visiting the Angels hopefully they find a prayer now elsewhere in the major leagues you've got Boston they're visiting the tribe up in Cleveland Baltimore will be at the Yankees Cincinnati <coughs> at Washington <coughs> Texas at Toronto Houston and Chicago Arizona at Colorado and your late game Tampa Bay at San Diego that was the Cedar Sports Corner Report get out to Cedars enjoy some great food and enjoy the games we'll be right back after we hear these the Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from Hi, their friends, I'm Gary West. And whether you find Augustine's Pizza at your local grocery store or at their restaurant in Newcastle, the folks at Augustine's Pizza hope that their pizza is always your first choice for any and all occasions. Newcastle's Brothers Market where you can get a money order, transfer money, pay bills, and play the lotto too. There's milk, juice, pop, and more. Yes, at two convenient locations, 1308 West State Street and 835 Moravia Street in Newcastle, where your business is always appreciated. Brothers Market, the market just right for you being stuck in the house and relying on others to take you places? Let ACTS be your professional driving service. Did you know that ACTS is more than just medical transportation? From trips to shopping, beauty salons, work and play, ACTS is here to get you there. We offer special low fares for senior citizens and passengers with disabilities. No income restrictions. For more info, give us a call or check out our website. Moving you forward. And we're back, and um, you know, the Holy Spirit Festival, which was a huge success you had to have clearances to be able to work for the festival now um, they're going to do the clearances again protecting God's children workshop available Wednesday the 21st a week from this Wednesday at st. Camillus McGurk call this is a one-time workshop is part of the safe environment along with clearances for all parish volunteers pre-registration required call 724-652-5538 extension 6 or 724-652-3422 and they'll get you all set up now I look this up Wayne Township Consolidated School. Yes, Wayne Township, just like north and east, I guess you would say, kind of, sort of, of Elwood City, had a school and a school district. They're going to have a reunion from 1 to 4, September 21st, at Slippery Rock Church, 528 Slippery Rock Drive, Elwood City. If you had anything to do with the school, taught, custodial, 
where anything they're asking you to go is from Kathy Brown. Keep in mind that the Pie Festival for the Newcastle area marching band is the 28th. Now, that's the Pie Festival. Let me give you a couple updates on where we're going over the next weeks. This Saturday, scrimmage at Grove City. Next Friday, not this one, I spat, don't get all excited, the 23rd. Okay, if you have the X1 box, okay, and you press Xfinity, go to you go to apps, YouTube, subscribe to NCTV45. Courtesy of a lot of great people, and you just saw the Cedar Sports Corner. You're going to be able to watch the game from the comfort of your living room, family room, right there. I suggest you get some great food to go with it. And tell Mr. Eddie Pegley thanks. Now, the next game is home. That will be against Montour. That will be on the 30th. So that gives you, <coughs> excuse me, that gives you the next three weeks for your sports look on what's going on. Make sure you don't miss it. Valerie invites you to a dinner party. Hashtag Ray Strong Benefit. Now, um, this is going on. Ray Kantz, who is currently in stage four uh, with, <coughs> with a type of cancer. <coughs> the event will be a great time. Proceeds go towards Ray and his family. Let's battle through this tough time. Saturday, the 19th. 12 at the Sons of Italy. <coughs> and uh, when we come back, paint the town silver. But you need to know about the weather. And right now, it's cloudy as a son of a gun out there. 82 degrees, feels like 83. Veritable winds at six miles an hour. Now, I expect you got to know about radar. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring that radar right up for you. This is Cleveland, Ohio. See what they're see what's happening there. The rain through Cleveland and through Ohio. Now, watch when we take a look at Pittsburgh radar. Still got a pretty good glimpse of it. So, um, with the winds variable at six miles an hour, as long as it stays north, that's why you've got this cloudy situation going on. We're going to take a look at Lawrence County 45 weather. And um, we're going to come right back with a whole lot more right after this. Joel, thank you to Tuscany Square Restaurant, Wilmington and Mitchell Roads, for providing funding for this program. Hello, 
Welcome to Lawrence County 45 weather. Well, after a splendid day yesterday and a mostly cloudy low of 61. How does your Monday look? And um, hot ziggity zagnut as uh, things are going to be just fine. You know, um, we're, we've been in for a great stretch of weather. And um, although it's been a little cooler than we might like, local radar shows nothing to uh, talk about. Now, there is a <laughs> disturbance, excuse me, off to the north and west seen on national. That's going to bring us some rain a little bit later in the week. But um, you're still going to like this forecast. Monday, sunshine 87. Monday night, partly cloudy, a low of 67. Tuesday, here comes some rain, mostly cloudy, 80. Chance of rain, 70%. That chance <laughs> hangs around Tuesday night, mostly cloudy, 63. And that's a 30% chance of showers. Kind of dissipates by Wednesday, partly sunny in 81. Wednesday night, partly cloudy, a low of 60. And Thursday, mostly sunny in 80. Thursday night, partly cloudy, 58. Friday, sunshine in 81. Friday night, mostly clear in 60. And Saturday, sunshine with a high of, you got it, 85. Now this was Lawrence County 45 weather. Get out and enjoy that sunshine. Not too bad of a cast with only two DB and a little bump in the road. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Nico and Sons Sales and Service, 347 East Washington Street, Newcastle, has lawnmowers of every type. Zero turn country clippers, made in the USA, 42 inch to 54 inch cut. Batteries by Oregon. They'll service at your home or their shop. Service specials start as low as $69. Call Jim Mico and Sons, 724-652-6911. Penn, Ohio Bottled Water Company, home residential, commercial, water coolers. You can contact us Monday through Friday, 8 to 5 p.m. We're fast, efficient, and we deliver water. We offer 100% customer satisfaction guarantee. Contact us today at 724-498-4760. Your family and friends will be pleased if you suggest dining at Mary's Middle Eastern Restaurant in Newcastle. Lamb and chicken dishes, stuffed grape leaves, tabbouleh, hummus, kibbe, and so much more from their huge menu. When you're looking for something different for your dining experience, then Mary's is the answer. Many of their customers come in from nearby counties. Mary's Middle Eastern Restaurant, located on Long Avenue in Newcastle. Call 724-652-2447. Arlington Market, located at 726 Arlington Avenue, has all the great food you remember. Yes, their canned goods are fantastic and feature that old world taste. And meat, cheeses, produce, lunch meats, fresh cut meats, groceries, and so much more. It's Arlington Market. It'll make your table look spectacular. And we're back and um, paint the town silver. Okay. Join us on this International Day 
overdose awareness. The event is focusing on providing support, education, and resources to help prevent overdoses and to remember and honor those lives, those lives of those who we've lost because of an overdose in the community. This is Saturday the 31st from 6 to 8 at the Riverwalk, right downtown. Family-friendly event, guest speakers, treatment providers, free health, free food, okay, music by DJ Glow, entertainment for the kids, candlelight vigil, and more. This is Recovery is Real, L-A-W-C-O-R-C dot org. For more information, call 724-658. 5580. And um, in case you were wondering, yes, two things. Tonight is the fair. So uh, make sure that uh, you get out, get to the fair. Number two. Okay, 5 o'clock at the band shell, Taggart Stadium. Parents, guardians, those from 7th, in 7th grade to 12th grade, there's going to be a football booster meeting. So you're going to want to show up for that, and they'll have goalpost forms and everything there, and probably a packet for you to see what's going on as uh, we inch closer to, yeah, football and hurricane football, and that's always something special. Now, um, let's take this break, hear from these great sponsors, and we'll be right back. LGKG.com. This program brought to you by Cummings Landscaping and Design. This Brand program sponsored by Lombardo's Apothecary, located at 1230 South Mill Street on the south side of Newcastle. Today's programming is brought to you by NC TV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. Well, that's going to do it here for NC TV 45 Newswatch Nightly. We uh, thank you for tuning in and would love to tell you to tell a friend about NCTV45. They'll be glad you did. And when they say, well, I don't watch a lot of TV, you tell them that NCTV45 is available anytime on your time. Yes, always in the pursuit of excellence, it's NCTV45 right here in Newcastle, Lawrence County. Now, uh, make sure that you get that second cold drink. I needed a cold one, folks. And have a super day in what I call the greatest castle in the world, in the county of Lawrence. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll see you again real soon. Got my ticket for the midnight plane, and it's not easy.